Hello, and welcome to the second episode of my special Halloween segment of Into the Past, showcasing the largest, scariest, and most feared ancestors of today's already feared animals. Last time we looked at the Bigfoot-like ape, Gigantopithecus, and today we'll be looking at one of the largest snakes ever, Titanoboa. Going back all the way to when the Bible was created, snakes have always been perceived by man as being perfect examples of evil and terror by their appearance. Even today, the phobia Ophidiophobia, the fear of snakes, is the second most common phobia, or even above the fear of height and death. Only behind the number one phobia, spiders, or arachnophobia, but unfortunately the largest spider didn't live in the prehistoric era. But luckily for you guys with arachnophobia, the largest spider to ever live is the goliath bird-eating tarantula, which currently is living today. Yeah! But back to the subject, to put it short, snakes have scared people since we have evolved. But we can now fear more since in 2010, Scientists found fossils of a giant snake in a coal mine in northern South America and dubbed the snake Titanoboa. From looking at some of the vertebrae and even parts of the skull that were found, Titanoboa was almost 50 feet long or 17 meters long and would have weighed about a ton in weight, making it one of the largest carnivorous animals to ever lived. It lived about 60 million years ago, about 6 to 4 million years after the dinosaur extinction, which is a very short span of time in terms of geologic time. During the Mesozoic era, Titanoboa and other animals such as mammals and even some birds had to remain small in fear of the dominance of the dinosaurs, but with them all gone, Titanoboa could grow very large. It gave scientists a rare glimpse of how the world was like right after the KT extinction. It was a top predator of its environment, which was a swampy rainforest area with strange creatures, such as turtles the size of cars and catfishes bigger than humans, and along with many crocodiles, fish, and early birds and mammals which remained small as the reptiles and fish grew very large, but all of the animals would be fair game to Titanoboa. Its pop culture references have been in the Jurassic Park Builder game, the TV show Primeval, Smithsonian documentary Titanoboa, and the new prehistoric game Ark Survival Evolved. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hello there everyone, it's Trey the Explainer. What the hell? And I'm here today to ask you guys to check out my more informative video about Titanoboa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell are you doing? Just telling the audience about my video, that's all. Well dude, this is like my channel. If you want to do that, do it somewhere else. This is my highlight, alright? Fine, whatever. Don't expect you to guest on my channel anytime soon. God, what a jerk. Anyways, check back here next week to see the next monster relative next week.